Assalamu alaikum. I hope that you are well, inshallah, and thank you for clicking onto this video. Now, if you have been following me on Instagram as well, you will know that last week I was in Spain, and right now when this video is being published, I will be in Spain again, inshallah. And that is because I've been co-hosting some retreats for Muslim women in Spain with my friend Abdiya. Now, we chose Spain for a couple of reasons, and actually this links in well with this video as to some reasons why I love Spain. I wanted to share it with you because I think a lot of us, especially here in Britain and perhaps the rest of Europe, do think of Spain as kind of like a beach destination, the islands, um, maybe not as diverse as it actually is. And actually, the fact that it holds so much history, especially when it comes to Islamic and Muslim history. But just going back, the first reason that I definitely love Spain is because of the weather. I am a Brit after all, and I do love the sun. We don't get it enough here. <laughs> so Spain is just fantastic for all round sunshine. I mean, I was in the southern Spain in Granada and Seville in November, and it was still so warm. And then I went to Malaga in May, and it was like, felt like completely like summer. So I love that you can get all year round warm weather and sunshine in Spain. Now the second reason I love Spain is that it is so diverse. I mean you've got mainland Spain which varies so much between north, south, east and west and then you've also got so many islands in Spain. You know you've got the cities, you've got the beaches, you've got the mountains, there's so much that you can do and they're very close together as well. Now the history of Spain has really intrigued me recently. As a new Muslim and as now a European Muslim, um, you know, I didn't know too much about the Muslim empire here in Europe. I think a lot of us do associate, you know, the growth of Islam with Africa, with Asia, with the Middle East, and you can often feel a little bit removed from that here in Europe. But it only takes a quick bit of research and perhaps a trip, if you are lucky enough, to southern Spain to realize how big the Muslim empire was in Spain. And this was one of the reasons we wanted to do the retreat in Spain and near Granada, because we wanted to be able to take the ladies to Alhambra, which is just the perfect example of the Muslim rule in Spain with Islamic architecture, literally the Quran written inside the walls of Alhambra. And on that note, you know, for many of us, Spain is quite easy to get to. Even if you're coming from the likes of North America, Madrid has a lot of good connections. And of course, if you're traveling from the UK or Europe, there are so many flights to Spain, especially into Malaga. And this means, especially as European Muslims, if we want to get a taste of Islam, that Islamic history, that Islamic architecture that we just love, you know, we don't have to travel all the way to the Middle East, to Africa, to Asia, which not not only costs a lot of money but also takes a lot of time and then my last reason I really like Spain is in terms of costs to be honest you know things in Spain do cost a lot less especially compared to the UK like food and drinks we went to a really good ice cream place which they could have charged you know like six euros or something for a really big pot of ice cream there was a queue all the way around the corner but it was only two euros and there is a range of accommodation and transport options as well so you really can kind of do Spain on your own budget. Now if you've enjoyed this video and you are a little bit more tempted by Spain then I really recommend you check out Cowbox. Now you might have heard me speak about Cowbox or you may have already seen it around. Cowbox is a new subscription video on demand service. It is going to be based inside the Muslim Pro app and from there you're going to be able to watch shows and documentaries on travel, lifestyle and history. So if you definitely are intrigued by Spain and the Islamic history then A Short History of the Moors um, for sure is a documentary you should watch straight away. And then if you love Turkey, if you follow my channel, you know I also love Turkey and Istanbul especially. Um, and there's a really great documentary called a Turkey, A Beautiful Diversity. So I definitely recommend checking that out as well. The links for Cowbox are in the description below. So make sure that you check that out. Come over and follow me on Instagram if you're not already so you can see my recent Spain adventures. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video, inshallah. <laughs>